show all like me here oh god it rumple up hey it will rumple up oh god it rumple up you understand it rumple up rumple up rumple up but here one i am here to educate you guys on how you should handle a trinidadian you understand because being from trinidad and being from the southern part in trinidad we brag and boast about the southern part of trinidad you understand? I am from the oil belt. When I say the oil belt, right? I am where the oil comes from. With the oil in your coil. You understand? You have to have oil in your coil in Trinidad. In Trinidad, it have a lot of things you don't say to a Trinidadian. It have a lot of things you, you don't say to a Trinidadian. You're one. You don't tell a Trinidadian. That split peas cook up is pilau. Split peas cook up can't be pilau. Split peas cook up is just as it is. Split peas cook up. It's not no pilau. You understand? Pilau is consist of. Listen here what it consists of. Green pigeon peas. You have some carrots. You throw in some carrots. You have that good old golden red butter. You have rice. You have your coconut milk. You have your salt meat, your pig tail. You understand? You could throw in some chicken parts in it. You understand? And you make a nice pilau. Don't go and say black eyed peas is, is, is pilau. Black eyed peas is black eyed peas cook up. Split peas is split peas cook up. But pilau is pilau. So that one thing you should learn. You understand? Now let me tell you something. In Trinidad, it has something called horn. You will get horn in Trinidad. And I ain't talking about them car horn that they be blown on the road, you know. You will get horn. So, horn is an integral part of the lifestyle of a Trinidadian. Ain't nothing wrong if you get a horn. When a woman get a horn in Trinidad, it's no big deal. You understand? Women are expected to get horn. Because we have real nice men in Trinidad and we have a bunch of beautiful women in, in Trinidad. Real beauty, real beauty. Beauty all over. Look, my hair scratching me. Yeah. So let me come back to the original topic. Trinidadians like to keep the house clean. We don't like a nasty house. You understand? And we don't eat from any and anybody. You understand? We have to see a yard clean before we come and eat from you. Trinidadian will tell you plain they're eating from you. You understand? And Trinidad likes street food. Trinidadians like street food. Oh, God, we like we doubles. When you come to Trinidad, the first thing you must buy is a doubles by the double vendor on the side of the road. And you're not taking that doubles home and eating it home. You're standing up right by the side of the road with a cold solo, red solo preferably, and you're eating that doubles by the side of the road. In fact, you might eat about two or three one time. And you're asking the vendor for plenty pepper. You're asking for hot sauce, you know, you want plenty pepper. You must eat our doubles. And don't talk for roti. Now we are all kind of roti. Let me see. We have dal puri. Dal puri is made with the, with, the, um, with the split peas. You understand? And you have to use a mill and grind that, grind that split peas. But now we have all kind of modern stuff. Now we have, you know, food processor and all of that. But the real thing is a mill. You put, a, you put the peas in the mill and you grind that peas. And you make a nice dal puri. And you're cutting it down with some stew pumpkin, some curry chicken, or, or so, so, some, some, you, you curry some goat, goat meat, and stuff like that. Alu, you understand? Some ancha on the side. You understand? That is how you eat your roti. Right? It has it have something called sada roti. Sada roti is a next roti. You understand? And now it has pepper roti. It's all kind of roti in Trinidad. And let me tell you something. Trinidadians love to sing when they talk. It, we are so melodious. We like to sing when we talk. Yes, we sing in. Bring it. I don't want it. 
Don't mess with me. Oh God, you like to make a contangle stuff. Bacchanal. We like to stress on the words. We don't say bacchanal. And even like that. Bacchanal. You understand? Bacchanal. See the melody. Bacchanal. Contangerous. You blasted. Hypocrite. 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 You go up and you come down. Hypocrite. You understand? Trinidadians are very nice people, but you don't want to mess it. You, you want to listen to me? Trinidadians are really sweet people. They're very nice and friendly. But you see, when you mess with a, when you mess with a Trinidadian, that is it, you know. That is it. That is it. They're telling you, they ain't putting no water in the mouth to tell you what they have to tell you. They're telling you plain as it is. You understand? And let me tell you something about Trinidad women. A Trinidad woman will beat your ass. You were saying she'll bust your blasted face because she don't play games, especially when coming to she man. If you play, you're going to take a Trinidad woman, man. You're looking for real trouble because you're gone. Here are the kind of hours they like to come and wake you up in your house when they know you take the man. Four o'clock in the morning. Four o'clock in the morning, they pull up at your house. Let's say your name is Deborah. They will call you and listen. By that time, all them macocious neighbors and them peeping through the window, peeping through the louvers, they just pulling the louvers like this and they mako in. Let's say, let's say her name is Deborah. She will come and say, Deborah! Deborah! I know you're sleeping. Wake your ass up. Deborah peeped through the window and she see her. Right? But before you peep through the window, it's because two big stones pelting in your house. You don't play with a Trinidadian woman. And Trinidadian woman know how to treat a man. They could cook. They could wash. They could iron. They could put away a house. You understand? And they know how to take care of the children. So, you don't mess with a Trinidadian. You don't, and, and watch me, Trinidadians not only speak with their mouth, you know. It's like how you, you normally you speak with your mouth if you have to respond to a question and stuff like that. No. Trinidadians don't really speak with the mouth. Trinidadians speak with the shoulder. They will speak with the eye. And they will speak with the hand. Watch the guest ears. When you want to speak with your shoulder, you do so. If you want to say you don't know, you do so. If you want to speak with your eye, you do so. You know what I mean? Who you are you talking about? Not me. It means not me too. And they like to suck their teeth. Suck their teeth mean all your mothers. Playing dog bad manners are gone. 